Hey, what's going on? What's going on, everybody? It's new here on that podcast. You just want to get a swig of water. It's hot. Sorry if you hear my air going and my fan going. I also got a candle burning. So you might hear a little crackly noise. I'm sorry. It's hot, and I'm sweating my ass off. Even with my AC going, because I'm just busy doing shit. And I smell a little funky. So I got the candle going to cover up that smell, because when I get to doing all this to finish cleaning the house, I'm going to go take me a nice shower. But what we got here is a comment. This is a Whitman. A 15 center Whitman. This is the Funky Phantom. Hanna Barbera. And this is the ghost of Montezuma. Now, this is the Funky Phantom. He is one. I want to say, didn't he appear like a crossover with Scooby Doo at least once? He's a Hanna Barbera character. Kind of Scooby Doo ish, but it's, they got three kids instead of four. They don't have a dog. They got a ghost, a chicken ghost, and a, a chicken ghost cat. So basically, it's the. You know, Shaggy, Daphne, Fred, and kind of Velma, but that's a dude. And I don't know where this one came from. It's not in the best shape. I mean, the cover, I need to do some repair work on it. But so I do is a flip through. I love these old Whitmans. These, a lot of this is what I read as a kid. My parents speak of have the, especially the three packs. Like three, the comics are a buck. Well, yeah, we're behind that. You know, comics were like 50 cents back then. So it's like I got one for free. The Mark's Jeweler ads, which is always great in these. Uh. Number three, authorized edition. Have you ever seen that before? 1972, so. Um, I don't know if this came out monthly or not. That's the Ghost of Mazuma. And the, I like how they got the art to look, you know, pretty much like the cartoon. It's on model. And they had a Doom buggy. And they I had a bulldog. And they just rode around and solved mysteries like Scooby Doo. There's the patches I did in a. Oh, what was it? Oh, it was a DC horror title. I did a look through with the patches. There ain't the same thing, same ones in this one. And this was a cool little cartoon that, uh, I, if I remember right, weren't they in Scooby Doo's Laugh a Little I think it's where I kind of back and I saw them the most. And then you know that episode Scooby Doo, but it was when Cartoon Network started doing a block, I think it was on Saturdays, might have been Sunday, where it's like all the Scooby Doo clones this, Jabberjaw, Clue Club, um, uh, Goober and the Ghost Chasers, yeah, all that stuff. And I would watch them because this is stuff I heard about and saw bits of as a kid, but never saw a lot because 72 is before I was born. This did not get rerun in my area. And it's typical ghost goofy. I like how, like, she's got these big, humongous eyes <laughs> with the eyelashes. The art on her is just crazy. I mean, look at that. And this dude right here in the green shirt looks like Shaggy, but he's not really the Shaggy of the group. He kind of is. But also, sure, Shaggy with the ghost guy. Um, dollar bargains. Okay, Sea Monkeys. Remember the Sea Monkeys? I had those, but I didn't know I had Sea Monkeys. I got a microscope one year, like a, a really cool microscope. My mom got it for me because I was kind of interested in science as a little kid. I fell out of it as I got older. But it included Brian Shrimp. You could hatch and raise, and I did that, and then found out later that's what Sea Monkeys are. <laughs> like, I want Sea Monkeys. And look, the sun coming through there, messing with stuff. Fretcher, Archibald Kern. Archaeologist. Oh, look! I want to buy everyone touches. Three dimensional. Oh, it's stickers. Okay, so I want Daffy, Woody, Porky, Peppy, Yosemite, Roadrunner, Tweety, Bugs, Sylvester, Smokey, Wiley, Coyote. Uh, all this shit. No. I like that poster. Oh, the second part of the Ghost of Montezuma. Look at the guy with the mustache and the parrot on his shoulder. Hold on. Look at that guy. Oh, Iron On Kids. Roche Designs are now available as Iron On Transfers. And we got Sweet Pea Felix. I'd want. I can't tell what that one is. Olive Oil, yes. Flash Gordon, yes. Um, Hulk, Cap, Spider Man. Popeye, Snuffy Smith. I love the Black Panther fist, but that would catch you so much heat around here. Keep on trucking. From white folks. You would catch you from white folks where black folks would be like, okay, cool, you know what that is? Yeah. The Black Panther stuff is so in the past now. And it sucks. Cause they did a lot of good stuff. They did, you know, they had their bad apples like everybody did, but they did a lot of good stuff. Um, another Felix, uh, WC Fields, White Fist. I love to keep on trucking. Oh, look at this robot, man. It looks like, uh, what was that, Robo Force with the suction cups on them? I had a couple as a kid. They were goofy. I heard their back. 
The 100 piece toy soldier kit. Remember those? I never had one. I remember seeing the ad all the time. And then dig these monogram models. Never did models. Just thought this would be an interesting thing to flip through. I love these old comics like this. I've got, you know, this one. I got like a Charlie Chan. I got banana splits. Yeah, I got a good handful of these. Now, some of these, like, some of these came from the, my local comic shop and they were in the cheap bins like this one's going to be. Some were in better shape and I paid, you know, a couple of bucks. You never find these for cover price. Hey, you rarely ever find them in the cheap bins. But when I do, I'll grab them if I can get them cheap. I'm out, everybody. Hope you enjoyed that. Remember, if you did, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you do. Ring that bell for notifications. And you know what? Share this video, please, on social media, whatever you use. And also... Leave a comment. You know what I want for a comment? What was your favorite of the Scooby-Doo ripoffs? You know, Funky Phantom, Speed Buggy, Jabberjaw, Clue Club, Goober and the Ghost Chasers, you know, all that stuff. What was your favorite? Mine? Hmm. Probably because I saw the most of that one. As a kid, mine would have been Speed Buggy. Because for a while there, the reruns there on Sunday mornings, I'd see them fall at church. But seeing more of it later on, nostalgia would be Speed Buggy, seeing more later on Funky Phantom. But out, everybody. Laters.